Good morning, YouTube. G'day YouTubers, today I'm going to teach you how to make the best cup of tea in the world. It is day two, this was recorded on day one because I got bored and I wanted something to do so I thought I'll, uh, I'll record how to make a cup of tea on day one and it's going on out there. Looks like the neighbours are trying to do something. Anyway, uh, you'll also notice the audio is a bit better on this. I've put my stereo microphone on there. So hopefully the audio is like, Ooh, amazing. Right, cup of tea coming up. Okay, for today's lesson in how to make a cup of tea, you will need a mug, a teaspoon, a tea bag, a lemon, some sugar, And a kettle. Okay, whilst well, the kettle's boiling, put the tea bag in. Boink. Get some ginger and slice off. I'm using the wrong knife. That's my chicken knife. And slice off a sliver, of, a sliver, a sliver of ginger. Chuck it in cup. Slice the lemon in half. I hope you can all hear this. Right. Put as much sugar in as you want. I have two because I'm not sweet enough. Well, it's actually one and a half there. Right. Pour hot water in kettle. Oh, no, hang on. I'm doing this slightly wrong. What you've got to do is wait until the tea bag comes to the top. Let me see if I can do this. Let me see if I can do this uh, so you can all see. This is called chasing the tea bag. Put the ginger to one side and let the, let the, how am I going to do this? We'll do it like this though. <clears throat> right. You've got to chase the tea bag around the cup. So nice and jelly. Remember going all the way through the tea bag. I'm making a complete pig's ear of this. I don't care. I'm bored. So that's it. You, so you're flushing out all of those all of the flavour. Now, give the tea bag a gentle squeeze. Come on, get out of the way. The ginger's getting in the way. Gentle squeeze and put it to one side. Boink! Give it a really good stir. Oh yeah, try and get it all splashing down the sides and everywhere. And then, take this and squeeze the lemon into a cup of tea. And there you have it. Leave, leave the ginger in there. I promise you now, this is going to be the best cup of tea I've ever had. There you are. Isn't that good? Oh, smashing cup of tea, right? Ooh, let's see what this chief can get up today. I'm going to upload this video later in the evening as well, this time. Anyway, usual thing applies. Peanut butter and toast. Job done. For those of you that are OCD, turn away now. Because you'll notice that I'm using the same knife, yeah, with little bits of butter, margarine on them, yeah. For the peanut butter. You know what? Because I'm a rebel and a can. And there's no one else in the house apart from me that can say, can you use a separate knife for the peanut butter and margarine? Uh, okay, breakfast is done. That was very nice. Now to finish off my nice cup of tea. Ah, I can't get in there. Ah. Oh. I've just changed my t-shirt because uh, I had a food stain down it. I need a bib. Anyway, 
Uh, do you like this t-shirt? Though? Hopefully you had enough time to read that. It's rather rude. No blind. <laughs> I've lost my vape. Uh, anyway, today, what am I going to do today? What am I going to do today? I have no idea. Absolutely no idea what I'm doing today. But at some point I will be going across to the shops. I would wear the gas mask across, the, across to the shops, but I think I'd either get arrested or beaten up or something like that. So, do you like that? This is my test t-shirt. <clears throat> it's got a hole in it. This is what I was using to test. Whenever I do a new design, it's like you've done like a little, you know, a new color, something like that. A new color I've just bought. Um, I always do a test on this or some other rough old t-shirt. But anyway. Uh, important news, everybody. Important news. News flash. Breaking news. There is a fly in my house, which means I am no longer in the house alone. I shall call him Bob. He's a little house fly. Where is he? He's on the window. Let's go and see him. Let's go and show you Bob. There he is, look. Hopefully you can see him. Let's see if we can get, see if we can get close to him. Look. Hang on, where is he? There he is. Good morning, Bob. How the devil are you? Hey, don't go away. We're trying to film you, little git. I think I think he's I think he's a bit camera shy. Bless him, little Bob. He's only little, isn't he? I can't find him now. Bob. I'm gonna get a little bit of string and tie it to his, his around his neck. Take him for a walk. Hey, yes, of course, because you're allowed to walk the dog. You're allowed to you know you're allowed to walk pets. I'm gonna go and walk my pet fly. I need a haircut. This is a mess. I might just shave it all off. What do you reckon? I've got three weeks to grow it back. That would be something to do today, wouldn't it? Shave my head. Very tempting. Well, that didn't last very long. Somebody left the door open and Bob has escaped. He's somewhere out there. I don't know where. But he's gone. Good luck, Bob. <laughs> Probably got hit by a car. Oh no, there's no cars. Everyone's at home. I'm sat here right now, it's really quiet. I've got the back door open. Can you hear that? Little bird chirping away, singing his merry little song. I've changed my t-shirt. Oh, I forgot to put a link. You know, last night, yesterday's video. Do a brain here, forgot to put the uh, link in the uh, subject. I'll do, it, I'll do it this time. So yeah, go and have a look at my page. You can have a t-shirt like this. I might put some bread out for that bird. Maybe the bird will come in. We can be friends. And I can call him Bob. Bob the bird. I'm gonna have a look in the garden, see if we can find any creatures to have as a pet. <laughs> I found a pet. I found a pet in the garden. <laughs> Come on then. You want to go for a walk? Come on. Come on. He must be asleep. Hello. Ooh, he did it. I shall hug him and squeeze him and pat him and I shall call him George because he's a fluffy little bunny rabbit. Snail. Yes, we'll put George back down and we'll, she'll watch him intently and see what he does. Hmm. Not very lively, is this snail? George. George. Yeah, f*** yeah. <laughs> Just kidding, he's silly. 
Uh, pet snail. That's doing nothing. Ah, oh, maybe he needs a mat. I'm not going in the garden to find the one. I can't be asked. See this here? Where is it? Hang on. I might have told there. There's a big gap here. I used to have a boiler there. And I had my heating changed to a combi boiler. Hang on, let's try and do this. And I've not got around to it. It's only been two, more, two or three months since the boiler's been changed. And I've not, just not got around to it because I'm lazy. Hey, I've got three weeks off work. Well, I haven't actually because the phone can ring any second. I can go out to an emergency job, which is a necessity. I've let George go. It was boring. There's no company, these snails. You know. I wonder if there's any caterpillars out there. Uh, yeah, so anyway, I chucked the snail. He was boring. I've thrown some bread out there for the birds and they're not going for it. Missable things. Anyway, news update. Drum roll, please. Prince Charles, heir to the throne, as uh, he's got coronavirus. Me and Fiona, my old metal detecting partner, We've been discussing making soup because I made some soup last night. I'm going to show you in a minute. Uh, so we're messaging each other through through WhatsApp. So I'll see you just pressing all the the voice button. So I've just got this from Fiona. With all of mine, I use one onion, whatever veg, and I I, I do a mean carrot and coriander. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So for that one, you need um, probably four medium-sized carrots. One onion or shallot, one clove of garlic. Well, I've got some. One of those um, stock pots. Mm -hmm. Take, pick your own flavour. Mm -hmm. um, a bunch of coriander, but you sweat off the um, veg in in your butter because that allows all the flavours to mingle. Once that's been done for uh -huh. about ten minutes uh -huh. on a low heat, uh -huh. then you add your liquid. <coughs> Sorry, you can put a tiny, a few teaspoons in when you're sweating because then it doesn't burn the bottom of your uh -huh, pan. Uh -huh. Then you add your liquid. Uh -huh. Then you cook it for about half an hour. Uh -huh. Then you blitz it. Yeah. Then you add your um, cream or whatever other liquid you're adding to bulk it up a bit. Like I said, I always add a potato. Yeah, that'll do. And if you do, do the coriander. Blah, blah, blah. Bless her. Isn't she good? She'll keep me fed. She, um... Yeah, we've been discussing soup recipes because I made my own last night. Let me show you. Let me show you this soup. It's really good. It was very tasty. It was a parsnip, onion, and an apple, and some milk. Let me show you this. Look at that. Ooh. That really does taste nice. That's tonight's tea. I shall put it in the pan and reheat it. <gasps> Guess who's back? Bob is back, he's come back. Oh, let's get some video footage of Bob. Bob! Hi right, Bob, how are you doing? He said, I'm just having a bath. What are you doing, Bob? It's exactly two o'clock here in the UK. What have I done? I went to the shop and I haven't done much more. Um, tonight, in a few minutes for you guys, uh, the International Space Station is flying over. I've got times here for the UK. <clears throat> I've been drinking Pepsi. Uh, I've got times here for the UK. I'm gonna overlay them on this bit here so you can see, okay? This is for the UK only. I don't know how it's gonna change for yours. Uh, but, um, but, um, 
I keep beeping. I've just um, I've had I've just had pizza for tea. It was lovely. Right, that's the end of the video. Because what's going to happen now is I'm going to edit it, make sure it's all okay, upload it to YouTube, and this is for tomorrow. I'm going to film the International Space Station. By the time you get this video, if it is what day is today? Banged my knee. It hurt a little bit. Don't worry about the time. You this whatever. Oh, I'm gonna shave me. Oh no, I've been told I'm not allowed to shave my hair off. Safe journey, Evie.